X versus MSI files, what are the differences? X and MSI files may seem to do the same thing, but they do have their differences. X versus MSI files, what they do. You might conflate an X file and an MSI file due to them being capable of very similar things. You've most likely installed a program using an X file, as well as with an MSI file. An X file is an executable file. This is a general term for anything from an installer to a standalone program, or even just code. An MSI file is a Microsoft installer file. This is dedicated exclusively to installing data using the Windows installer. You cannot run an independent program from an MSI file, but all programs are installed using the Windows installer. The distinctions of the X format. An X file is defined by how highly customizable they are. Because an X file can execute any sort of code, it gives ultimate flexibility to developers. A developer could insert code, an installer, or even other X files within one. This leads to the main problem with X files. So, the main distinctions of an X file are as follows. Can be anything that executes code, such as installers and programs. Highly customizable, it's possible to layer X within an X. Vulnerable to viruses. The distinctions of the MSI format. An MSI file is defined by how limited they are. They must also meet standardized requirements and no unauthorized code can be inserted. This makes them generally safer to run. This is because, essentially, the MSI file type is how the entirety of Windows manages the installation, maintenance, and removal of software. This also means that you can actually run into system bugs that prevent the MSI file type from running properly. Thankfully you're always able to fix issues with the MSI file type, but you should still keep it in mind. The main distinctions of an MSI file are as follows. Can only install, maintain, or remove. No programs or code can be launched. Meet safety requirements X files do not. Generally safer to run. A core component of Windows. Is either X or MSI better? Not really, MSI and X were both built for different tasks and both meet different needs. The MSI file type will help you install, maintain, or remove software on your machine. So, unless a program has provided you with both an X and an MSI file for installation, it's not a choice you're going to have to make. What if you are faced with that choice, though? Well, an MSI installer package is more likely to be a straightforward installation, whereas an X installer can be loaded up with more options. For example, you might be able to download and install multiple versions of a program using a single X file. Another aspect is security. If you don't trust what you're about to install, seeing it as an MSI file should make you feel safer than if it were an X. As long as you're keeping your Microsoft Defender up to date, even that shouldn't be a huge concern. X and MSI, working in harmony. These two file types, most often associated with installer packages, actually depend on each other quite a lot. An X file couldn't install anything without the Windows installer, and inversely, you couldn't run your installed programs without an X. While they share some similarities, they share lots of differences as well. Thankfully, it doesn't need to be a choice in most circumstances.